Hi, this is a demonstration of the boat wiring flash that I designed for our boat. You can download a copy at the big sailboatproject.com. It's an interactive program that you can use to search through any wiring in our boat right down to schematics and board level. As you can see, it was kind of inspired by Star Trek. I've zoomed in in several sections here, like on the main power bus there, just so as you can see, because we're looking at a full-size computer screen with a 320 by 240 resolution, not very good. As you can see, you can get little areas on the boat. Um, this is my desk. That was my desk. And uh, zoom them in and get all the information about it. Here's the uh, main breaker battery panel. And different areas show a 3D animated grid of where the wires run and how they're run and what they're running to to give you a better good I better idea of the whole thing the way it's hooked up. Some of these elements are interactive even in images. Uh, I don't think this one's working. Nope. <laughs> I can go to the pedestal which is in the cockpit and look at all the circuitry in the display there schematics zoom in on sections of schematics and sections of those schematics zooming in The breaker panels are pretty important. There's three separate breaker panels. Here is the main one. So this one's a little bit more extravagant. It has a search. I'm searching for light right now. So everything that has the keyword light will come up on here. It's about six or four, sorry. And once I find which light I want to look at, I can click Related, and it takes me all the way back to the dashboard, where there's a switch panel that shows me it's the steaming mast light. And the circuit schematics, particulars, what brake it's hooked up to, etc. Some of them are more elaborate than others. There's the horn. The horn actually sounds when you push the button. And here's the windless solenoid and setup, which is a little complicated, but it's all laid out right there. And then there's other ones that's got sub schematics and sub circuits and links out of there in case you need to get to them quick. There's one there, and this is the rudder control or rudder uh, display and uh, dimmer, dash dimmer control, which has its own little sections, even its communication protocol with the dash pick. All this information is off of promain.htm on the big sailboat project.com. More schematics. It's nice to be able to have all this stuff arranged and it's not on paper, so it's not bulky. This would be a stack of paper if it wasn't in software which we've left behind and stored elsewhere. And there's a new circuit we just added to the autopilot. <laughs> Actually drew it in here before we we just got back from installing it. And this is a dash. It's not exactly laid out the way the dash really is, but uh, it's easy it's laid out in a way it's easy to find things. And there's the radar. I can click on a schematic link with the radar and zoom in because Flash has its own zoom control, which is kind of cool. And I can zoom right into it. Like there's a circuit, a power circuit. And I can zoom right into it like that. You can probably even see it in this lousy 320 by 240 resolution. And I'll just get out of that. So there you go. And here's the mast. Um, 
um, which shows color codes and wires and what everything's hooked up to in the mask box. And uh, here's the notorious dash pick unit, which is fairly complicated. I won't try to explain what it does here because this video can't be as long. <laughs> but as you can see, all the information, coding, can be called up instantaneously. And th this program is continually growing. Every time I do a change, this is my priority to change this. Now I can go to pedestal straight from here. I'm following some wiring. And just by doing that. Yes. You can look at various layouts. Here's the galley area. Even the lighting schematics and circuitry is uh, shown here in the board layout. In case I decide I want to change something that's down the road, which I do uh, quite often. Here's the entertainment center. Uh, media gate DVD type video hard drive player and the way it's wired into the Ethernet hub and etc. etc. And all these plugs and everything are shown. There's my mini stereo and the schematics. And it's just sweet. I can bring up uh, the schematics anywhere. I can. I even have the manual for it listed in here. And there's the board layouts. If I want to change something, it makes it pretty easy. And get all of that. Each section has its own window also that's divided, as you can see, and even the radar arch is shown. So if you want to play around with this, go to www.thebigsailboatproject.com and it'll be listed there.